Hey there, it's Richard Brandt, Monos Historian, and you're watching Stream It Now. New rivals in Amazon Prime include Those Rangers Just Keep Powering Up All Over. Yes, it's last year's reboot of the Power Rangers franchise. Other notable additions today? The Philip K. Dick adaptation, Radio Free Albemuth. Helen Mirren in The Passion of Ayn Rand. Another film from the great Dutch director Fons Rademacher, The Knife, from 1961. Several Russian movies, including an adaptation of the Brothers Karamazov from 1969. Paul Leiden's creepily imaginative horror film, Come Back to Me. Dark Harbor is a triangle involving Alan Rickman, Norman Reedus, and Polly Walker. Nothing says, hey, let's make a sequel in name only to Essex Boys 17 years later with none of the original cast like Essex Boys. Laws of Survival. Also, more kung fu classic action with The Gangster Matchmaker. And there are three short films with silent comedian Frank Butler from the 1920s. The Great Outdoors, Hot Stuff, and Let's build. Then from about a decade later, no joke, Hitler is my neighbor. Then there's an Austrian thriller, Kill Daddy Goodnight. A 90s low-budget slasher film, Killer Nerd. There's also a sequel, Bride of the Killer Nerd. And for good measure, a spy comedy from Gary Graver, Nerds of a Feather. Then we have uh, some musical performances from both the Muddy Waters Blues Band and the Muddy Waters Tribute Band. And as a bonus, Tom Jones, Live in Australia. There's Patrick Stewart in the paranoid thriller Safe House. The Maori Family in the switcheroo comedy 17 again. D.B. Swinney in the football drama Underdogs. The Yes Men are back in The Yes Men Are Revolting. And finally, Amazon Prime makes the Triple X trilogy complete with Vin Diesel and Ozzy Argento in the original Triple X and Ice Cube in the sequel Triple X State of the Union. You're welcome.